Hello, I'm Sung Hun Lee from ICU Linguistic Lab. This is a video about comparing three different types of recordings uh, that we made in the previous video. So if you look at the first sound, uh, sound test uh, uh, that was recorded first, uh, that uh, the sound was recorded with the nice green bars. And uh, what we can see here is uh, we see the spectrogram in the bottom and uh, the waveforms on the top. If you look at the left side of the waveform, uh, there are numbers minus 0 0.5877 to 0 0.4856. And this means uh, from the minus one to one range, uh, we are using about half of the range or slightly over half of the range uh, of loudness in order to uh, make a record. So this is a good recording uh, uh, that we can use for acoustic analysis and uh, every other things. Let's uh, look at the second recording that we made. It was uh, made with very soft voice. And if you look at the second recordings, it looks very similar because uh, it had actually the same kind of sentence. Hello, my name is Sung Hun Lee was recorded. However, what you can see here is now there's a lot of uh, noise uh, recorded together, but also crucially, if you look at the left side, now it's uh, using only 7% to 9%, or about a very small amount of uh, the range that could have been used for recording. This usually means uh, there's, an, uh, there's a possibility of not having all the information that we want from the sound file. So we want to avoid uh, recording sounds that are too soft. Let's go to the third recording. Here, when we did the recording, uh, there were red and yellow bars that we saw. And uh, interestingly, on the left side, now it's between minus one and one. However, the sound files are not just between minus one and one, it's actually uh, going beyond this minus one and one, and this is, uh, uh, this is called clipping of the sound file. So the last sound file, uh, if I zoom into that last sound file, uh, zoom into the last sound file, it uses from minus nine uh, uh, to 50% of the range that can be done. So um, this can, uh, file can be salvaged and uh, probably can be used for other recordings. But uh, if you look at the second recordings, and if I zoom uh, in, zoom to selection, we see in the waveform that a lot of the, uh, uh, <coughs> a lot of the waveform uh, parts are passing through the range uh, that the microphone can be record, uh, can perceive. And as a result, uh, we are losing actually uh, information from the signal. So this kind of uh, too loud recording needs to be avoided. So thank you.